Hello and welcome to the Helios blog. My name is Helios. Today we're going to talk about cluster B personality disorders and why you should avoid people with these traits. This is an extremely important topic and this will lead to the prevention of many potential problems in your life. I'm going to talk about what the cluster B personality disorders are, what traits they contain and why you should avoid people like this. You'll see that the greatest cure is prevention in the case of these people. Here we go. Enjoying my content? Check out my blog at heliosblog.com. On YouTube, you can support me by liking and subscribing. I'm also on Spotify if you prefer a podcast. If you're interested in my books, The Strategist's Guide to Seduction and Quotes to Live By, they're available on Amazon. In addition, you can follow me on Patreon at The Helios Blog for exclusive content. On with the show. What are Cluster B Personality Disorders? Cluster B personality disorders refer to a group of psychological disorders which lead to consistent long-term patterns of terrible thinking, feeling and behavior. So here's a list. Number one, antisocial personality disorder. Number two, borderline personality disorder. Number three, histrionic personality disorder. Number four, narcissistic personality disorder. Obviously, since we're aiming for a life of consistent long-term happiness, we should totally avoid people like this. I'm, trying to, I'm going to describe each disorder and the traits that each have so that you can be forewarned and prevent the huge problems that are caused by dealing with these types of people. Of course, if we're talking about women, if she has these traits, she is to be totally avoided for any kind of relationship. Antisocial personality disorder. People with antisocial personality disorder have a total disregard for the rights and feelings of others. People like this lie and cheat in order to achieve their goals and are extremely manipulative. People with this disorder feel no remorse for their actions and are more likely to be addicted to drugs. Here's a list of traits to look out for. Persistent lying or deceit for the purpose of exploiting others. Callous, cynical disrespect of others. Extreme arrogance. Recurring criminal behavior. Failure to plan ahead. Lack of remorse and empathy. The recurring abusive relationships. People like this have a hard time hiding their bad behavior. Any behavior like this is an extreme red flag and you should immediately remove yourself from the presence of people like this for your own safety and long-term happiness. Obviously, even if it is easy to sleep with a woman like this, I never recommend you do so. The amount of long-term backlash such an action will have on you is huge, avoid at all costs. Borderline Personality Disorder People with borderline personality disorder have extreme difficulty maintaining relationships with any person. It's much more likely for women to have borderline personality disorder than men. Men in relationships with women who have this disorder often have horrible things happen to them. If you see any of the following behaviors or patterns of behavior in a girl, run. Intense fear of abandonment often leading to extreme behavior to prevent it. Idealizing someone then on a whim suddenly believing that they're cruel. Extremely impulsive behavior. Suicidal threats of self-injury, often when told that their relationship is ending. Giant mood swings. Constant feelings of emptiness. Inappropriate intense anger and fighting. Periods of extreme paranoia. If you see even one of these traits, I recommend an immediate termination of all contact. Believe me when I say that you will not come out of such a relationship unscathed if it lasts for any prolonged period of time. Women with borderline personality disorder are extremely dangerous and toxic to men. Tread lightly. Histrionic personality disorder. Women are much more likely to have histrionic personality disorder than men. They always strive to be the center of attention. They'll even do these attention-seeking behaviors in inappropriate situations. Here's a list of traits that people with this disorder have. Uncomfortable unless they're the center of attention. Dress provocatively and can demonstrate flirtatious or seductive behavior in inappropriate situations. Act dramatically without sincerity. Rash decision making. Fake suicide for attention. Overly concerned with physical appearance. Easily influenced by others. Low tolerance to frustration or criticism. Obviously, a woman with such a distorted self-image is impossible to please or have any kind of relationship with. I'd recommend entirely avoiding these kinds of women for your own happiness. 
A woman like this cannot be in any kind of stable arrangement as they are extremely likely to cheat on their partner due to their extreme impulsiveness. Narcissistic Personality Disorder Both men and women can have this disorder. People with this disorder believe that they are superior to others. People who are like this never care about their partners, only about themselves. Here are traits of people with narcissistic personality disorder. Extremely negative reaction to criticism. Elevated sense of self-importance. Constantly thinking about success. Excessive need of admiration. Strong sense of entitlement. Always think they're right. Talk about themselves a lot. Exaggerate their talents and achievements. Women who are like this never think about their partner, only themselves. As a result, they're extremely likely to discard you for another partner on a whim. Also, due to their extreme entitlement, narcissists are impossible to please. Since they're a constant headache, I'd recommend avoidance. Why we should avoid people with these disorders? We should avoid people with these disorders because they're extremely likely to contribute negatively to your life. A person like this has no regard for others, only themselves. Since they have such a lack of care, they're extremely likely to explode their relationships and the lives of those around them. The low empathy and lack of regard for others also means that these kinds of people are extremely toxic. They are to be avoided. What happens if you fail to avoid these kinds of women? If you fail to avoid these kinds of people, you're bound to get burned. Many men who end up with borderline personality disorder women, for example, end up stabbed or accused of horrible things. You want to totally prevent these problems. You do that by identifying the problem and not playing their game. Once you've identified that a person has the negative traits that make up cluster B disorders, they are to be immediately avoided. Conclusion: As you can see, people with cluster B personality disorders are to be avoided. You can thus prevent the extremely negative problems that people with these disorders can cause in your life. Once again, here they are. Antisocial personality disorder. Borderline personality disorder histrionic personality disorder, narcissistic personality disorder. Pay attention to the signs and prevent the problem.